Oh my gosh, this is so dirty. As much as we shook this thing out, I am shocked at how dirty it is. Yeah. Which side goes down? Do you remember? Or the double? The dark, yeah, the double dark. Nope, the other side. Yep. Goes up because mm -hmm. it can't be loose. Hey, Tucker. It's day one. Time to relax. That's what we're doing. <laughs> Although we still have to put the lanterns in there. Yes. We have an outside fire. dinner cooking over some coals with pretty much all the windows open because it is incredibly warm in here and it's March and it's beautiful outside. What are you doing, Tucker? Hmm? Crunch, crunch. Goes the wild corgi. What? Nothing. 
Nothing. Nothing. Don't want to kiss on camera? No, that's fine. What? Nothing. This would be a lot easier if I was by myself. I'd have no one else to talk to. I can go hide. Why'd you turn your face? What? I Why? They're pointing at me. <laughs> I'm just glad he's eating. Me too. This is the first time we've gone camping and he's ate dinner without complaining for the most part. Let's hope this isn't burnt too much. Right. It did get a little crispy on the stove. Oh man, it's still really doughy. Oof. Oh, that's like burnt soup. Yeah. camping in a couple years. First <laughs> failed meal ever. Just hold these up high. That would be great. Really would. Eyebrow still there? I think so. My knuckle hair, however, is not. <laughs> Bad camera angle. It's great. <laughs> mm. 
noodle went flying. Five second rule. Ew. <laughs> well, here we are. It is 8.10. All done with supper. Our freeze dried supper. Because it didn't work out. Tucker's worried because Katie went to the bathroom. He doesn't know what to do. He's used to sleeping in the back of the truck, not in the tent. Fire's slowly glowing. I really don't think we're going to need the, the fire going all night. Guaranteed we're going to fall asleep for hours and hours without it being on. I'm not worried. Tonight's low is supposed to be 42 degrees. So, that's nothing. Your sleeping bag is rated for zero degrees. Be time to get ready for bed. Relax soon. What's the matter, Tucker? You sleepy? Up and over. Oh. Right. Packing her in tight. Yeah. This little stuff like, burns so fast. Probably not powdered in hell in here, but. Okay. Feeling we'll be asleep before we know it. Blanket. Tucker, you're in my spot. You're in dead spot. <laughs> Tucker, you're getting ready to fall asleep. Mm hmm. It's my spot, though. Mm hmm. Sweet and sassy boy. You're sweet and sassy boy. Morning. <sighs> Did not sleep well last night. Hi, hey, bud. Tucker's very interested in everything that was checking us out last night. Should have grabbed the camera when the owls were right over head. They were. I've never heard owls like that before. That was cool. Okay. So, we've gotten cleaned up from last night. And we have coffee. Local coffee from Door County. Unflavored, or flavored, black and unsweetened. So we have since added coffee creamer and now we're deciding on breakfast. Chris is lounging with his brownie batter coffee and Tucker is grumbling because he is stuck on the table. Hi Tucker. <coughs> we'll get unstuck. Hmm. Should we go help him? I suppose. 
Come here. Come here. Come here. Come on. Go that way. There you go. That's it. You're free. Tucker thinks he's a wild animal and buries his food with sticks under the tent. Good, or you think a couple more? I have fruit. I have some strawberries and blueberries and stuff. Oh, I have mushrooms too. Yes. I might slice up some mushrooms and cook those after the potatoes are done. Because that sounds delicious. <laughs> Check that out. Biscuits and gravy. He's got two big biscuits, a bunch of gravy, and all the sausage bits. You want to take that outside and crush up the biscuits? Yep. Because that is so messy. I have baby sets of potatoes. One thing you'll come to find about us is we love cooking with cast iron. So we have this tiny little one that we leave in the truck. And we just got a new camp stove. Um, and it's not a cast iron stove. It's a cast aluminum it's from Blackstone. So we'll see how that works because we pretty much exclusively cook with cast iron skillets at home and out and about so we'll see how how those how the new stove works Tucker this is gonna take all day <laughs> we have to get in all the know about this come on Tucker come on bud you're fine see we're not in any rush. You can just take the gun. Nope, brush out. My bottle of dough. Come on, Be careful. Go yeah. slow.
at the end of the trail, or at the beginning, depending on where you park, is the lime kiln ruins. and still wanted to keep people off the top. Yep. Redbird, chief of the Winnebago's. feet of gain in one stretch really makes it work for it <laughs> can feel it tomorrow yes Tucker's been keeping up though he is tired he will nap when we get back to the site same so, after our post hike relaxation nap for Tucker Now, wood cutting for this evening. We now have neighbors. Yay. Not me. <laughs> cool down. Hopefully, enough to make it through at least one piece. <clears throat> from the top of the lookout tower. It's absolutely stunning. Hi guys. Crazy windy, but it's beautiful. It's so pretty. It's so not gonna last that long. Nope. <laughs> it's gonna be ruined by the end of summer. Yep. At least everything comes apart. It seems like it'll be easy to really be able to clean it. So tonight for supper, we're having sourdough melts. Sirloin patties, fresh sourdough from festival. It's about 4.30, starting supper early because we did not eat a lunch, just snacked a little bit after our hike. Tucker is somewhere. Nope. Under the table. Under the table, sleeping, kind of. We were blessed with two new neighbors this afternoon right next door. <laughs>
I've never had old people be so loud before. <laughs> right? Like they think they're outside, nobody else can hear them. Mm -hmm. Newsflash, we can hear you. Yes, definitely. It's been a quiet afternoon though. Once they got set up, it was, that was it. Yeah, might have just been related to backing in the trailer. <laughs> That's my guess. <laughs> Over Tucker tired. Over tired Tucker. Hey, bud. You okay? Hi. <laughs> we got our little fire going here. We got a forest fire. We have a bonfire next door. We have a Tired toddler. Huh, bud? <laughs> What's the matter, bud? Oh, my. Morning's breakfast. <coughs> Toast, coffee, lemon berry granola. Let me take a bean. Tent is empty now, almost. Got some chairs set up in here so we can have a breakfast in peace. And the last little bit of remaining stuff we gotta pack away. And Tucker still has not ate his dinner from last night. Go bury it again under the tent. Okay. 